in midweek, but something's rubbed off from the Italian job and Tom Mooney's opener and the approach play that went with it wouldn't have looked out of place in Serie A. It set the tone for a stylish, swaggering South End performance and a second from Ricky Otto, who just seems to be getting better and better, wasn't bad either. The third owed more to the good old-fashioned British approach than the continental touch. Andy Edwards heading his first of the season. And Oxford, stuck at the wrong end of the table, knew it was all up for them by half-time. Andy Ansar twisted and turned. His left foot shot deserved a goal, but Mooney following up got it. Three goals in three minutes livened up a second half that couldn't quite reach those standards, but nearly did. David Penny pulled one back. But it was almost the worst thing Oxford could have done. 60 seconds later, there was Otto again swooping from the left for a repeat performance at 5-1. They could afford to sit down on the job, but the break for afternoon tea didn't last long. Mooney was quickly back on his feet, and when he picked the ball up on the south end right and headed for goal, he only had one thing on his mind, his hat-trick. 6-1 to south end and their biggest league win for 10 years.